bring up all the famous guys, or the ones that think they're famous, the ones that I think, actually the ones that Frank Stanley thinks are famous. And then I'm going to bring up the top ten on general classification. I'm going to start out with a young, a not so young guy that I used to race with not so long ago. He was a 1984 Olympian. He has tons of Masters titles under his belt in Masters racing. And here he is racing in the Pro 1-2 division. Please welcome Thurlow Rogers. Thurlow Rogers, come on up here. Winner this year of the Fitchburg race down in Massachusetts. Please welcome John Peters. John, come on up here. Where's John? There he is. This young man finished the Tour de France this year running for the U.S. Postal Service. He is the champion at the first union race in Atlanta. Please welcome Marty Jemison. Marty, come on up here. Tyler Hamilton's only teammate in this race. Oh, Nate is here. Can't forget Nate. He'll be up a little bit later on. Where is, where is he? Is he up here? There you go. All right, now, please welcome the winner of the Tour de Fleur, Tour Le Fleur Road Race this year, Levi Leipheimer. Levi, come on up here. Right for Colorado Cyclist Comptel. Where's Levi? Now welcome, please, the champ of the Chris Thader race, Ashley Powell. There's Levi. Ashley Powell, come on up. Where's Ashley? Levi, you're supposed to come from that way, not that way. All right. Please welcome, ladies and gen gentlemen, the U.S. Amateur Road Racing National Champion, Paul Martin. Paul, come on up here, riding for Saturn. Now please welcome, running for Nutrafig, the top amateur in the NRC standings, Olin Baki. Olin, come on up here. Where is Olin? There he comes in that yellow Nutrafig jersey. And now a man who has won this race more than once, the champion of the Nevada City Classic this year. He is currently second in the Pro Tour. Please welcome Scott Munninger. Scott rides for the Navigators, and he... He is no stranger to the podium here at the Killington Stage Race. And now, please welcome the only guy in the pro field, I think, that is older than I am. 1996 U.S. Olympic team member, and currently the Smart Fuel Sprint leader. Let's hear it for Team Shackley's Kent Bostick. Here's a, here's a man who I also used to race with back in the old days on one of my old teams, a 1988 Olympian, former U.S. Pro Champion. Please welcome Norman Alvis. This young man put on the green King of the Mountains jersey after the race uh, yesterday. No, it was the Navy. It was after the Sunrise Mountain Road Race for all the way from South Carolina. Please welcome Skip Spangenberg. Skip, come on up here. He's got that green King of the Mountain jersey. King of the Mountain jersey, of course, courtesy of Saab. Now please welcome the champ from the Hotter Than Hell race down in Texas last weekend, the Canadian National Time Trial Champion, Eric Wolberg. Eric, come on up here. And now another rider from the U.S. Postal Service team. Here comes Eric. Another rider from the U.S. Postal Service team. Stage winner in many international and national classics. Past Perry Roubaix finisher, Sea Otter champion this year. Please welcome Nate Reese. He is in 10th place currently in the overall standings.
Right now, I want to welcome, you know, ladies and gentlemen, in the pro race today, believe it or not, this whole weekend, the U.S. Junior National Team, these guys are 17 and 18, are competing with the pros in preparation for the World Championships, and we have two national champions from the national championships in New Haven, Connecticut, three weekends ago that are with us now. I want to bring them up now. The first one is Joshua Thornton. Joshua Thornton, come on up here. He was the winner at the World Cup race in Quebec to the Tour de Levitibi in July. He is the current junior national road champion and the junior national criterium champion, Phil Zajcek. Phil, come on up here. Now I'd like to bring up ninth place currently in the race, rider number 11, riding for Team Saturn, Mark McCormick. Now please welcome the Core States U.S. Pro Champion, Cyclocross Super Cup Champion. Please welcome eighth place rider in the race, riding for Team Saturn, number 12, Bart Bowen. And now, please welcome, riding for Team Everfresh, winner of the final stage of the Tour of Texas this year in March, please welcome number 99, Sylvain Beauchamp. In sixth place, currently in the race, the NRC leader, winner of the 89er stage race and the Cascade race, the national pro and amateur, the national time trial champion, Please welcome Jonathan Vodders. And now, riding for the team, Espoir de la Val Naya, the man who had the leader's jersey for the first two days, the winner of the prologue time trial. Please welcome number 113, Matt Anand. Matt Anand. Anand. All the way from Quebec. In fourth place, currently in the race, a man who really needs no introduction other than his name here at the Killington Sage Race. Two wins at the Tour of Malaysia, the Pro Tour leader this year, former multi-national multi champion in the Pro Division. Please welcome, riding for Team Saturn, rider number 16, Frank McCormick. Currently third place in the Killington Sage Race, riding for Team Saturn. He was second yesterday. He's the Core States Classic Champion, former U.S. National Champion. Please welcome Chan McRae, riding for Saturn. And now, a two-time winner of the Killington Stage Race. Third place yesterday, riding for the Navigators. Please welcome Mike Engelman. Welcome number 171, the Canadian Espoir National Time Trial Champion, Mark Walker. Mark Walker, come on up here. Walters, Mark Walters. And now, the man you've all been waiting to see, the Mount Washington Hill Climb winner, former collegiate national champion, rode the Tour de France this year for the first time, finished with the U.S. Postal Service, winner of yesterday's. Brandon Gap Road Race, please welcome, ladies and gentlemen, the overall leader currently in the race, Tyler Hamilton. Tyler, the New England favorite. And now the rest of the field, please, to the line. Look at the size of this field, ladies and gentlemen. It is going to be a good race here today, as it always is in the Pro Division in the Killington State race. Gentlemen, you have 56 laps in the race. 56 laps in the race. There will be smart fuel sprints at 40, 30, 20, and 10 laps to go. We'll ring the bell here, and then you will sprint here for the smart fuel sprints. There is one King of the Mountain at the halfway point. I have a special prize too. With 25 to go, 
There's a $200 brief courtesy of the Mountain Times Magazine. It's their 27th, 27th anniversary. And I'll try to get as many other briefs as I can. No more free laps after eight laps to go in the bike race. Remember that, no more free laps after eight laps to go in the bike race. You may be pulled from the race if you are deemed out of contention by the officials. They will pull you here at the line. You'll be given a prorated time and you will be allowed to continue tomorrow. 25 seconds, gentlemen, 25 seconds. We have an honorary starter with us today, ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome, from the U.S. Postal Service, Vicki Provost. She will be firing the gun. Five seconds, ladies and gentlemen, five seconds. Runners ready, go! They are off. Thank you.